Hey peeps. I did a little bit of damage on Memorial Weekend sales. Not as bad as I could have done, but I am here to show you this collective haul that I'm super excited about. It's a little late just because there were items that were coming in a little late, so I waited until everything was here. So I have that as well as what I purchased during the Ulta um, hair event that was going on also around that same time. Okay, let's jump in. So the first place that I purchased that was at Sephora. So I got so lucky. The Pat McGrath palette came back in stock for, it's originally like I think $78. It went down to $47. I had my eye this on it last Christmas and I wanted it so bad. I just couldn't justify spending that much money. But now that it was almost half off, I definitely had to pick it up. It wasn't in stock for the longest time, but it did come back for seriously like 10 minutes or something and I happened to catch it. And this is what it looks like. I don't wanna blind you, but it has that, it has a mirror. Look how gorgeous these colors are. They're so pretty. I love it. I've used it uh, probably two or three times. And I love the opacity of it. It's fantastic. I love Pat McGrath. All her um, glitter shadows are so, so pretty. Their shimmer is beautiful. It lasts for a long time, so I was really excited to pick this one up. Okay, so the next item I have is this Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe and coconut water. This is the little guy. I think it's, yeah, two ounces. I love all those Mario Badescu facial sprays. They're so nice. They're so refreshing. They're perfect for summer, especially the two ounce ones are great for travel. I actually leave one in my car. Um, I, it's not like, you know, out in the sun, but I put it away and it's so fabulously refreshing. The sprayer on it is amazing. You can't even, yeah, see, it gives you a little bit of glow. I remember we did 14ers, my best friend and I, and we came down to the car and I'm just like spraying this like it's going out of style. It makes you feel amazing. Love it. I thought the aloe was also a good touch, um, especially in the summer. So, okay. The next place that I got something from was ColourPop. I went a little crazy with palettes. So this is the Bare Necessities palette from ColourPop and it has two, four, six, two, four, six, two, four, five. So 30 colors in there. Look how beautiful. It doesn't have a mirror, but I think that's what makes them like so cheap and they keep that price low like that for their customers. So beautiful. There is one person that I watch on YouTube that I have followed her bridal tutorial to do my makeup for my bridal shower and my bachelorette, I think. And that's the palette she used. I love all of these cool tones, warm tones. You have purples, you have browns, and then you have um, shader colors to deepen the eye look. I just think it's so beautiful. I love all of these shimmer ones. Like, look at that one down there. That's so pretty. That one is in Silk Teddy. So I love, I've been eyeing this palette for so long. They had 30% off, so this went down to like $23 and they had free shipping because I purchased something else. But this is so beautiful. If you're just looking for an easy go-to palette, no colors, you're just a simple girl, just go for this palette. It's so beautiful. The quality on it is amazing. So love that. And I'm a huge fan of ColourPop's gel eyeliners. And I only had a couple from them, so I wanted a full set. So I got a full set from it. I am so excited. There is two, four, six, eight, ten eyeliners. And I think it was $28 after the sale. So each eyeliner was under three bucks. So that's how I looked at it. And these are all colors I would actually use for sure. And let's see here. So this is what they look like. These are the colors. Look how pretty. I love all of these. I did take one out, I think, for our travel. Um, but I love all of these colors. Easy to glide on. I don't think... I don't think they are... 
like waterproof or anything, but they're so creamy. They're so easy to use. The color are so opaque. It's so beautiful. I love this. So I have been eyeing them for a while and I'm like, okay, I'm already doing an order for the palette. I'm just going to add this and get my free shipping. So love that. The other place that I went to was Morphe online. So they had some Jaclyn Hill cosmetic um, items on sale and it's her line, the Jaclyn line. And she, I think for her website was like $60 or something to get free shipping. Morphe, I think was 35. I'm like, okay, I'll do the Morphe. Plus they had extra sales on them. They were 50% off on top of their prices. So this is the translucent powder. I heard quite a bit about it. I did swatch it. I haven't used it on the face yet um, because I just wanted to see if it was pretty smooth. That's what it looks like. There is a mirror here at the bottom. And look at that. It's so iridescent. So, so smooth. I could tell you that. It's like micro smooth, which is what I love. I don't want it to feel cakey on the face. So I think this will blend in really nicely. This was also all the rage. So this is the brightening and setting palette. And this one was for medium skin. I think this one was actually light medium. Yeah, light medium skin. But I would use this under the eye. Um, I could use this on the cheek or to even just like mattify my T-zone. As well as these other guys depending on how tan I am for the summer. But I heard so many good things about it and I am so excited to try it. And I thought this would be perfect for travel because you have four powders ready to go here in one. The other two items that I added on there is actually her or Morphe's Beauty Blender. I love this one. This is actually one of my favorite beauty blenders to use like dupe. And this one is the highlight and the contour. So it has the two flat sides on it here. And this one is rounded side. So you could use that for your concealer. But I love this one. And I was like, hey, it's on sale. Might as well add it to my cart. And I love it. This one was a Morphe and Jaclyn collaboration. I have been looking for brushes like this, like dense, to use for powders and also for foundation. So I thought this would be really nice. It says life's too short not to own bomb brushes. <laughs> I love it. So this is the Rider Dye Foundation brush. So I'm excited to say, try that one. Okay. So the next thing we have is what I got from Ulta during their hair events. So the first thing I got is the Fakai Apple Cider Detox Rinse. It's a conditioning detangler. This is good. Um, it's vegan, cruelty-free, sulfate-free. So if you have colored hair, this is really nice for that. I actually got it for my mom because she, she uses conditioner religiously when she colors her hair. So I thought this would be really perfect for her. That one is 8.5 ounces. And, you know, when you click on the links that I'm going to link at the bottom so it's easy for you to find these items, just remember the Ulta items were 50% off. And keep an eye on that because they do repeat these events and they do repeat the items that are in there. So if you love something so much, just put it in like your loves list and grab it whenever it's on sale next. Okay, so I have been hearing about these for a long time that I wanted to pick them up myself. So these are the Kitsch satin pillow cases so this one is kind of a leopard this one is silver super super soft so this is supposed to help with hair breakage and um, frizz so I do have some frizziness in my hair and of course I do get some breakage um, and it also helps with preventing acne and gentle on the eyelash and eyebrows gentle on the face as well while you're sleeping so these were again 50% off I thought this is the time to try it. So I grabbed um, these two colors to see which one, you know, depending on the bedding. I thought this one is for cool tone and this one is for a warm tone bedding to go with them. I'm excited to try them. I haven't tried them yet. So we'll see how it goes. All right. So the next item, I got this Madison Reed Radiant Hair Color Kits. 
I don't color my hair very often and I don't use bleach. So anything like that I could put on top of my hair. Just give me a little bit of like hint of color. I love since I have like dark brown hair, you could actually probably tell there's a little bit of redness in there. I love the red, maybe even a little burgundy purplish too. Um, so this one was, I think, $15, and it had really good reviews. So I picked up the Catania Dark Mahogany Brown um, to try that. So excited to try that at home. Okay, so they also had this Sebastian Dark Oil Silkening Mist that I was reading about and it sounded amazing. Like, I just want something to smooth my hair, make it feel nice, smooth. Um, so this one was on there, and it says spray evenly over hair before blow dry or refresh your style. It's a lightweight mist for silkening effect, ideal for a quick touch up. So I'm going to try that and see if I like it or not and let you know. The other thing I picked up, I picked up a few Diva Curl brain items i tried one of her gels that went into like last sale or whatever at tj maxx and i love it so i said okay i'm gonna go back diva curl was all the hype when it first came out and it was always full price but now they had quite a bit of them as half off so i picked up a few of these so i picked up the flexible hold hairspray and it says stay put style with flexibility wind and humidity resistance first control and shine it has very high claims so i hope it keeps up with that because that's what i got it for is all of these claims and this one is 10 ounces um it says the finish is dermatology co-develop d i'm not sure what that means but i'm excited to try it i picked up some gels like i said so there was the Diva Curl. So this one is light defining gel. And I also picked up the medium defining gel. So this is 32 ounce. It's a big daddy. I think it was $24.99. And I ended up picking up both because I couldn't decide between them. And they had gift with purchase. If you purchase stuff for $50, I'm like, hey, I'm already purchasing all this stuff. I'm going to add to it and see if I like it or not. So it says it's soft hold, uh, no crunch styler. So here's my little beef. So I tried the medium defining one. It's great. It does define your curls, but I feel like it absorbed the moisture out of my hair like crazy. Like it's so dry. I said, okay, maybe I won't use it the first day. I'll use it the second day to kind of refresh. Just use my regular styling creams for the first day. But even the second day, it did pull up all that moisture and it just made my hair feel dry. So I'm still debating if I'm going to keep them or not I probably will return it the medium but I haven't tried the light yet so I might try that one and see if that one doesn't absorb the moisture out of my hair as much and it's hopefully will be good for us okay I'm running out of room okay so so I also picked up this perfect smooth conditioner and shampoo uh, from Nature Lab, these are 22.9 ounces. I picked up the refill bottles because I do have enough bottles around from other shampoo and conditioner that I finished. So I figured I'll just kind of dump these in there and try and see if I like them or not. And I'm also going to post this one as well. So this is the other shampoo and conditioner that I picked up. I'm actually using it right now, which is why I forgot to grab it with me. But I do love it. It makes my hair feel so smooth. And I could tell it doesn't really reduce frizz. I could tell you that. But it does make my hair feel very nice, very moisturized. So I'm excited to keep keeping using these. And then also try these ones that are actually perfect for smooth. So we'll try that. They say it's color protectant, sulfate, and paraben free. So we'll see about that. Okay. So what I picked up as well is this uh, Invisibobble um, Hair Scrunchies. And these are like the little plastic ones that you see the Invisibobble, but it has cloth around it. So it does look like it's crunchy. I love these. They're so soft on my hair because sometimes the other wobbly ones, they get caught in my curls. So these are so perfect for that. I love these. They look really cute. I could wear them at home. I could wear them out. I love those. And there is two in here. Okay. 
So the other thing that I got is I got some tanning stuff because I'm more at home, but when I go out, I want my tan to intensify and stays as long as it can. So I picked up a few things to try, see what I want to keep. Um, but this one is the You Glow Girl by B Tan. It's a gradual glow mist tan. So this one, I haven't tried it yet. It says glow boldly where no one has glowed before. Tan mist and go with this gradual glow tanning mist for face and body. It says it's easy to use. Spray on the face and body evenly. Keep nozzle at least 15 centimeter or six inches away from the skin. Um, allow a few minutes to dry before applying makeup or sunscreen and you're ready to go. So I am excited about it. It had really good reviews. That's why I ended up picking it up. Okay, so the other um, tanning item that I picked up, this is the Australian Gold. This is the Bronzing Intensifier Dry Oil Mist. So that's what I was actually striving towards, but it was sold out for a while, and I just wanted to pick it up. So it finally came back in stock after I picked up the other item, so I still ended up picking it up because it's originally $10, and I think it went down with a coupon for $8. Um, so I was able to pick that up. It has tea tree oil, banana extract, and it's cruelty free. And then I also picked up the Stand AF Intensifier. It contains no sunscreen. Also by B Tan. It says this will keep your skin hydrated while getting tan. This Lux Coconut Tanning Oil has got it all going on with seven moisturizing oil and a boost of self tan for the darkest banging bronze. I'm excited about that. This one is eight ounces. I think it was also around the same price, like eight to ten dollar range. And then the other hair items that I ended up picking up to kind of finish up this haul right here is this Living Proof Nourishing Styling Cream. This is, I think, originally $26 and it went down to 13 or it went down to 19, something like that. And it, it's only eight ounces and it's living proof. So it's a really good company. I've gotten many samples of them and I've always taken them with me when we're traveling. I absolutely love it. It's just a nice cream. After you come out of shower, you put it in there, style your hair, put some hairspray and it's so beautiful. It keeps the curls moisturized and it keeps the definition of the curls. So I absolutely love that. So when I saw this on sale, I'm like, okay, Let's just bite the bullet and get it. And my plan is just kind of dump them in like little travel ones to keep taking them with me. Again, this is eight ounce, so it's going to last me for a while. I'm so excited. It does say it does soft frizz and lightly conditions. That is 100% true. The last two items I picked up was this Diva Curl Plumping Primer bodybuilding jelly for all curls so this is five ounces and it was decently priced which is why I picked it up I don't spend that much money on gel because it just I mean I feel like I get good definition with them I haven't found any gel that really reduces frizz to be honest so that's why I do the leave-in conditioner before like after I get out of the shower put in leave-in conditioner that has frizz control because when I go in with gels and stuff like that it doesn't keep that frizz at bay so I wanted to try this it says for ultimate curl flexibility again it's vegan safe for color treated curls not tested on animals so I'm excited to try that and then the last item I got is the inner sense quiet calm curl control it's a styling cream to hydrate um, and shape your curls so this is kind of like the living proof I do use that the first day when I come out of the shower it's a curl cream because if I try to do a curl cream the next day my hair is just so dry it doesn't work but this is fantastic after the shower I love these um, so that's why I haven't heard of this brand and it was really pricely put so that's why I picked it up to see um, if it's good or not. One more thing before I forget also, I did pick up this Eva NYC shampoo and conditioner. Here's a picture of them. Really, really good. I've used it once and I like the Eva NYC, the main 10 in one leave-in conditioner. So I'm like, okay, let's preempt it. Try the shampoo and conditioner. See how I feel about it. I really, really like it. I used it once. It didn't control my frizz very well so I'm gonna have to try it again and see if I like it or not um, but for the first time I enjoyed it it left my hair soft 
It's just the frizziness is so hard to control, especially in the summertime. So anyway, so that's the other item that I picked up. And then I will show you my free gifts with purchases. This is how I get all my samples that I give out to friends or I use myself. So this was a bag that came in with 50 or over when I bought the Diva Curl items. So this is like tanning items. And then this one was another one. One of the days it was like a MAC deal. So it has a lipstick. It has a MAC Fix Plus, which I love. It has two mascara samples. And then the other sample that I got was also another tanning one. Um, this one is more, I'm sorry, this one is sunscreen. The other bag was staining, but this one is sunscreen. And because I put two separate orders that same day, I picked one for this one and one for the other. So it's awesome. That's one thing I will tell you. So if you do have an order that's $100 or more and you want to split it up into two, you could keep using that gift with purchase. So that's what I did. I picked up both of them because I ended up having like a big order. So I split them up that way. Um, another day was a philosophy gift with purchase that day if you bought stuff for $50 and it has like a couple perfumes and a skincare sample in there. I love the bag and I love that it's clear and it's plastic. It's so nice and sturdy and from Sephora they had this free gift with purchase also. It's a Briogeo and it has shampoo, conditioner and a deep conditioning mask. And it came in this like sample and it also has other samples in there as well. And I'm like, oh my God, this is a gift with purchase. Are you kidding me? And these are each two ounces. So this is items that I took when we were traveling for the wedding because we were gone for a whole week. So I used up this whole thing and I even came home with more and I loved it. So keep an eye on those gifts with purchases. This is how I get to try all the items that I like and whenever they go on sale I am able to be like yes I've tried this I love it now I want the full size of it and please come back to my channel like and subscribe I love doing this I love doing hauls I love picking up stuff to tell you what I like and what I don't like so you could spend your money wisely don't waste it we don't like doing that and always get a best deal that you can all right everybody I hope you're having a good day and I will talk to you later bye peeps